What's up guys, YT Brickbolts here, and today I'm going to be opening up a Brickmania order. I believe this order costs around $60. It's nothing in particular like a new release or anything, just some stuff that uh, me and my older brother, YT Brickboy, picked up. So uh, yeah, I guess I'll get straight to opening it. Uh, I believe we bought this about a little under a week. Brickmania shipping is normally really good, so yeah, let's just get it open. But let's just see what is inside. Ooh, some really nice stuff in there. I guess we'll get started with the minifigures that you guys see. This is actually the Brick Mania US uh, D-Day Infantry, which is really cool. The US D-Day Infantry minifigures. They got their D-Day Assault Vest, uh, Gas Mask Bag, Belt Strapping Around, a ton of gear on. They got their little trench shovel. Gators, really, really nice, loaded with gear. They also come with the custom printed helmet. I think it's on backwards, that's why you can't see his face. Uh, here's the other minifig. He's got the helmet off so you can actually see his uh, face. Here is the face that it comes with. Really, really nice head. And then same thing on the front and back. My older brother got two of these USD Day minifigs, which is really, really nice. And then we also got a bunch of Brick Arms accessories, which I will dump out for you guys. Wow, okay, that is very messy. As you guys can see, he got a bunch of these dark gray U-clips. These are actually for vehicle building. Um, these are actually the POM plastic version, which is the plastic identical to the one that LEGO uses. The other versions of U-clips that Brick Arms makes is a thinner plastic and breaks easily. And I believe they only specifically make this in dark gray, maybe black, don't quote me on that. But um, yeah, this is mainly for like vehicle building. You want a really nice sturdy piece, which is really cool that Brick Arms does that because the other ones do break very easily. And then my brother also got a bunch of these monopods. Some of them for, I believe, machine gun handles, which are the brown ones. And then the black ones just for random uses. They can be pretty useful sometimes. And now we'll get to the bag guns. First, we have this M240 machine gun that I bought. I bought this for my Humvee. The, actually, uh, the same Humvee that I have on my uh, Fallujah mock. If you guys want to go check out that video, you can. I'm putting this on the top of that Humvee. Because before, I had a different machine gun that's not too accurate. Uh, and then my older brother got these two... Uh, Brick Arms MG34s, which is pretty cool. And then the last few guns that I got were assault rifles. We have your standard black M16, a Brick Arms Dark Tan ACR, and then a Dark Tan M4 Phoenix. Also, I forgot to show you guys, I did get this Brick Arms Gunmetal M4. So that is everything that they got in the order. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe. And until next time, goodbye.